Off tonight, customers of a Tri Cities based credit union are on alert after about a thousand customers had their information compromised. We begin here on News Channel 11 at 5 o'clock. Good evening, I'm Josh Smith. And I'm Sarah Diamond. Eastman Credit Union posted a security alert on its website saying an increased level of card fraud related to card skimmers, which may have been placed at local gas pumps, has prompted this alert. It came one day after Bristol, Virginia police announced the arrest of two suspects accused of putting skimmers on gas pumps. Investigators said the two are suspected of covering places between Knoxville and Washington County, Virginia. News Channel 11's Justin Soto is in our Kingsport newsroom tonight. Justin, you spoke with both the credit union and a victim of this today. What did you find out? Well, Eastman Credit Union executives telling me late today that around 1,000 customers were impacted by card fraud at ECU ATMs. And now they're working with local police to get to the bottom of exactly what happened, telling me tonight that a fraud of this magnitude has never happened to ECU before. The fraud itself took place at ATM, so they used debit card information that they obtained somewhere. The question Eastman Credit Union executives are still trying to answer is how card information got in the hands of criminals. We have been in contact with local authorities to help us investigate this. ECU acting quickly, saying members are covered and should see no financial impact as a result. We started yesterday uh, morning to uh, open um, fraud cases and provide credit back to our members. Members like Jesse Odom, who filed a report with Johnson City Police. Whoever got my information, they withdrew from an ATM in Johnson City. I was livid. I was like absolutely mad because, you, you know, that's an invasion of your, your money and what you work hard for. I was like in the negative, like 400 and some odd dollars. Odom is from Kingsport and visited her local branch Monday morning. They just said that they had been dealing with this most of the morning. So I know a couple of friends that have Eastman Credit Union accounts and they all had the same sort of issue. I could not ask for anything better. They were more than helpful and quick on the spot. And I mean, it, they even called me yesterday um, because they picked up the fraudulent charge. Odom now has a message to others, although she's vigilant of things out of place. Just be a little bit more cautious and, you know, check out the ATMs if you can and see if there's something on there. Um, but like I said, I looked for them and couldn't find it. ECU is offering multiple tips to customers tonight, including to report any suspicious activity to them. Meanwhile, Kingsport police tell me they're investigating multiple cases of card fraud, both inside and outside of ECU. Some of those cases involve skimmers. Reporting live in the Kingsport newsroom tonight, I'm Justin Soto, News Channel 11 in your corner. Now, skimmers are far beyond just Eastman Credit Union ATMs. There are many reports around the region of skimmers being used at gas pumps, allowing criminals to steal card information when you're fueling up. The Federal Trade Commission website has tips to avoid skimmers, making sure the label on the gas pump panel is not cut or broken. Wiggle the card reader. That might help you be able to determine if there's something attached before you insert your card. If it moves, report it to the attendant. Use a different pump. And also, the FTC suggests using credit instead of debit to avoid giving away your PIN number. That's what they're after. For more tips on how to keep your information safe, go to our website tonight. We've got lots of information on WJHL.com.